Hi guys, this is Sweet Mugsy. Welcome to my channel. You guys look at what I'm wearing. Tell me in the comment section if you. On me. For now. Let me look at what I'm wearing. Tell me in the comment section if it's good. I need to wear shoe now. We're going to the park and this. It's spring. It's spring already now. So let me wear. I'm not wearing shoes. I'm wearing sandals. Oh, oh my God. Look at Stanley. See. What is that? Tell him, look, look, look. What is that? It's Can, you a touch? Dinosaur. Can you touch it? No, touch the dinosaur. Oh, okay. Go and touch it. <laughs> no, it will not bite. Look at this one. See what that Steady, come out, come out. Did you me? Don't touch it. Steady, breathe. so tired and famished i'm not tired are you guys i just entered on instagram junior poop is dead how is that possible god immediately i saw it i logged off because this live eh? somebody with three children i just finished making a video i don't even know how to think it my heart started beating like i know him one on one this guy is a vibrant young man may he so rest in peace so we are back i want to make dinner now i'm so tired immediately we came back from from the natural nature museum we went to the park still he played a little bit he rode himself like so immediately we came back i had to bat him 
and I'll give them some things to munch on while I get dinner ready. So yeah, I'll see you guys soon. Hi guys, so it's been like two days since my last video. I haven't talked to you guys um yeah so it's like two days two days later i just finished washing the dishes in the kitchen so um Stanley said he wants to ride bicycle i want to go and take him downstairs to the garage so that he can ride bicycle and after that we'll just ride bicycle like you know until like 5 30 then we'll just head over to samara school straight from there to go pick samara come back make dinner put them to sleep and of course fix their wardrobes sorry if you're hearing any noise telling is at the corridor playing so fix their wardrobe because their wardrobe arrived like since monday or tuesday i don't remember but it's just been there because after looking at after looking at the double packaging that came with this wardrobe almost to fix itself just the tire us yeah so that's it and then on sunday we'll be going to if a, a friend of mine invited us she decided to host us or she wants to host us so we're going to her house and i really don't know if this vlog will continue to sunday i mean yeah so but if it does it just in case let me just put it out there because after going to the garage to ride bicycle i don't think there is any other thing i need to film there's no need filming when i'm going to pick samara so that is basically just that <laughs> nothing much go ride bicycle pick samara and come back home and then spend the weekend i also want to lose samara's hair yeah i want to lose samara's hair but my mind i don't really have strength to make her hair this weekend so my mind i'm like okay she should just manage the hair till next week next weekend i will lose it because if i lose that hair um this if this friend of mine she invited us last week and i said no like i was busy and i still don't want to give excuses okay because this is someone i invited for my son's birthday she didn't she had she wanted to she had plans of traveling but she canceled that plan in just um that traveling just to come and spend some hours with my family and me so i don't want to continue giving excuses sometimes to go to people's house you know you just be like i need to plan myself i need to plan myself but yeah i feel like you just have to be very intentional when it comes to friendship when they give friendship is a give and take something so there is no need of saying ah, i don't want to guide you just cancel everything you know i meet up too as a friend that is what friendship is if i'm to say so that is that we're just going to ride back yeah. now guys how is where is this it's actually okay my camera is bright now you guys it's been a day for me he's been a day i've been up since morning working Stanley, stop calling me not yet i'll call you okay you guys it's been a day for me like i've been up since morning i've been working Summer I didn't go to crutch today. Meanwhile, we I, we went to my friend's house yesterday. It was fun. I didn't bother to film. I just wanted to be in my reality and not carrying camera around. She really, really hosted us well. The kids bonded very well. And she made a one soup for me and the kids. And even gave me the remaining to bring for hobby. So it was it was cool. Yesterday, yesterday with her was really, really cool. Now this afternoon, Stalin has come to tell me. That he wants to go back there the way light is going off and on here i don't know it was really really sunny today it was bright outside maybe it's the way is um the way i'm facing i don't know yeah but it comes and it goes it comes and it goes if you notice this kitchen is bright but the light from outside is the one obstructing but we'll continue so Stanley came this afternoon to tell me he wants to go back there because he really really had fun yesterday. Yeah, but that one aside, this morning I woke up. Samara just woke up in the morning, early in the morning. 
came to our room, immediately she came, she was like, Mommy, for her to talk, ooh, on our bed. Hey, <laughs> good. She vomited. So I started like batting her immediately, cleaning up. That was when my chores for the day started. And you guys, Sundays normally are my setup um days for the week. Like cha I change the sheets. On Sundays I do a lot of things. That's when I used to change the sheets and then you know whatever pyjama the kids were wearing yesterday they're never going to wear it again like they wear a new set that's how i do it so my kids wear one pyjama two nights if they wear this night they wear it next night it's okay i put it in the laundry basket and wash so they repeat one pyjama twice yeah so whatever pyjama even if they wore it yesterday i don't even mind like i will wash everything and you know the bed sheet will be new the new pyjama everything will be fresh so that is what Sundays are for me in this house. But on Sunday, I only change the bed sheets. So imagine changing the bed sheets and you've only slept on the bed sheets one night. They're not even up to 24 hours. Samara came there and vomited this morning. And all the bed sheets I even changed. I did not even wash any of them because we are going out. So this morning, I had to wash like four bed sheets. Four. Two from us. Samara vomited on the new one I changed, so I removed it and washed immediately. Then the one that we used last week, I had to remove. Um, yeah, I changed it on Sunday. So, I washed four bishes this morning. No be smart, you know. But yeah, that one is done. I'm making lunch for them. They are having late lunch because I just wanted to like finish up everything I'm doing before I will start. Because giving them lunch, you just need to stay there. So you have to stay. If you want this place to still be neat you have, even when you are there safe, they go still scatter around so i just like want to like have my bath i've had my bath i don't know if it's just me as long as i'm in the house i must wear my hair bonnet i don't like hair it's touching me i don't know if it's just me i've just been like this since even when i was with my parents as long as i'm home i'm not going anywhere i just put on my either hair net or hair bonnet yeah, I'm making lunch for them and after giving them lunch, I brought in some clothes I want I want to fold. I'll go ahead and fold them and put them in their respective positions. I cannot relate to like having a place in your house where you pile clothes. I don't know about that. I cannot relate to it. <laughs> I don't know. Because maybe because I'm not, I will not say I'm overly organized. I know I am organized, but you see bringing in clothes. I'm putting it somewhere no if i bring it in it would rather be in a bag i don't even want to see clothes hanging around in my house just put it in a bag when you are ready arrange it that's me i don't like bring it in and put it somewhere and say letter no and if i ever bring in clothes and put it somewhere and say letter just know that my letter is like immediately letter maybe i want to um hang my kids clothes on the hanger i just brought in the dried ones put it in their room after hanging i'm going immediately to like you know put because if you don't even put it safe this children will help you and scatter it so my letter is my immediate please it doesn't even take like a day or two or hours no once i bring in clothes and they are not folded i'm folding it in less than 30 minutes max you know so that is it i want to give these guys lunch they're having a late lunch then after that i'll fold my clothes you, you guys can see the weather it was really really sunny today all of a sudden the wind from nowhere boom just started like that and now the sun has gone i don't even know if it wants to rain i don't know what it feels like outside but i know that it's very very windy outside um if it makes sense to me later we can go out and ride bicycle because they want to go out and i i might be tired i might want to eat it but there's nothing i can do right that is my life in the daytime, in the daytime, I really don't do much for myself. It's at night that I like do whatever I want for myself. But in the daytime, I focus it on them. Yeah, Stellan is having fries and burger meat. Samara says she wants noodles and burger meat. So that's what I'm giving them. Still track of 
breath before I die